What can we expect as we head into the Memorial Day weekend? Hopefully some sun and maybe a little bit more warmth, Steve. That's exactly what's going to happen, Rob. Just leave a little bit of sun tomorrow and that warm weather coming after that. Uh, and certainly not beach weather. And we even had a statement from the Weather Service that talks about our beaches all around the area. Nancy Addy is checking in from LaPorte where it's 51 degrees. She always sends us pictures from near Michigan City. And look at the beach there. Be careful with the strong rip currents tomorrow straight through the day because of the northeast winds off the lake. Pretty gusty at times. Let's move on and talk about the rest of this weather story. Hey, we're drying out at least. Uh, most areas only have some light rain that's falling now. It's just plain cool in most every other location. It's only 54 degrees now at O'Hare. Overnight tonight, we'll keep the clouds and the temperatures will stay pretty steady down about 53 at 6 o'clock in the morning. And then we'll get into the 60s as the day wears on 60s. That ought to feel pretty good. So relatively cool tomorrow, mild on the weekend. Are you thinking about your weekend plans for the holiday? Here's the way it shapes up. Saturday, about a 20% chance of some showers. But look at that warm weather, 74 degrees. 73 on Sunday, still have a 30% chance of showers. And then Monday, about the same story. So... Uh, keep an eye skyward over the holiday weekend. It's just one of those things where it's not a washout, but from time to time you might get some rain. And this thing is pulling away, thank goodness, that low. All we got to do is try to take the cool air with it, but that's still going to take a while. So as the seven day unfolds, one day tomorrow under 70 degrees, and then from Friday straight through Monday, we're in the 70s fighting the clouds and at times some showers. But at least the warm weather's coming when we'd like it to be there. Get those clouds out of here for the weekend. <laughs> Thanks, Steve.